You all ready to learn how to make a pizza the right way? Making it great. Yes, Keep I'm ready. I'm going to cook pizzas great. now. Well, there's a lot more to it than just cooking. In fact, that's probably the easiest part. Are you sure about that? But let's start this process at the beginning. First of all, are your hands washed? <laughs> Good, mine too. All right, let's say an order for a pizza comes in. You read it and you'll get started on the pizza making process right away. You have to act fast. Just think, the sooner you get that pizza in the oven, the sooner our customers will be biting into it and tasting it. How delicious it is. And they'll have me to thank. <laughs> That's right. This is the retarder. I love everybody. It's where we keep the proof dough until we're ready to use it. So we take out a medium pan prepared by our real master. Now this one looks good. See, if the dough weren't right, if it was stuck to the separator, or it was too flat, or it had air bubbles in it, then the finished pizza wouldn't be right, and our customers wouldn't get the best possible product. Which they deserve every time they visit Pizza Hut. First, spread the sauce to within a quarter to a half inch of the edge. Now for a medium pan pizza, two spoons equals five ounces. Be sure not to pour the sauce onto the center of the dough. And don't press down with the spoon because that could cause the pizza to be undercooked. Which, by the way, is out of the oven. Come on, I'll show you how to take it out and serve it. We always use a pan gripper. God damn, God damn motherfucker! Burn my goddamn hand. This new goddamn demon, you son of a bitch! Okay. It ain't big around me down on the bottom! I'm this motherfucker! This one looks great to me. It does.